Hello Internet, and today I have for you AFK Journey 2's beta cell test. Wait, so this is what it looks like, Tap the Gear Journey. It has some really fantasy adventure advice to it, and we are going to just take a look what's new with the beta and what if there's anything changing, right? But yes, here we go. It starts off with some cutscenes, baby. And as you can probably tell, the quality, it is good. We've got Merlin. No. Oh. We have some animation, baby. But here we go. The game is starting, man. I'm pretty sure you guys should listen to it. But as I click this, there is voice um, acting. So let's just actually focus on if it's good or not. Magister Merlin. Ah, your old problem has reared its head again. And there we go. That's Dolly's voice acting. It's actually pretty dang good. And the story kind of starts with you having amnesia, which is, you know, it's pretty typical. It's pretty typical. You lost most of your power somehow. Your memories are fragmented. That is like the starter pack of any fantasy game. And of course, we have the starter pack as well for any RPG fantasy game. A cute guide NPC. But yes, these are basically the story. I'm not going to spoil out too much, but this game is currently on its beta. So yeah, if you really like this game, you can look forward to it. And we get to select our character. This is similar to like a lot of games these days. You usually get, you know, you, you get a male character you know, and a female character. And what's unique is that you get to customize. I think a lot of games should do this more. Just let us customize, man. That is adorable. How about we some red eyes? Whoa, that looks spicy. Now I'm going to name myself like anything. It doesn't really matter what we name. Call me Risley Bay. Well, this is also just the way that so information will not stay. I will not be called Risley Bay if I really do, you know, decide to play this game. But we have now the first moments of the gameplay. If you've been following this game for a while, you know how it goes. Right, you got you know this cursor here. You get to walk around like this, which is essentially something I've kind of just never seen before. This is a mobile game and it's available for PC. And of course, I didn't mention this, but the landscape mode that I showed before will be available um soon. But for the beta, though, it's not quite yet. Anyways, we just walk around. This feels like you know open world. It doesn't feel like your typical AFK game for sure. And the game honestly looks beautiful. If you like this aesthetic, you will absolutely fall in love with this. Let's follow the uh you know waypoint here. We got Chippy. Start a path for any fantasy game. A pet like. NPC that acts as a tourist. But yes, I've already read through this story before, uh, before and as I will tell you, I'm not gonna spoil too much of it. And there we go. We got Chippy just like that. Up until this point, the experience is similar to what I had in the PTR server. But here we go. We got some plot and some animations as well. Look at this guy. Gosh, Dang, General Hogan. But yeah, the animation in this game look kind of like this. It's got a very, you know, Disney vibes to it. I've already said this before, but yes, it feels like Disney. But anyways, we have some animations here. It's pretty sick, to be fair, right? Like, look at it. It's a mobile FK game, so there we go. That's what you would expect. And this is some of the uh, battle gameplay. So usually you could just leave this on auto. But you know, if you want to battle it, you could. Sometimes you would rather battle it. We have Hogan's skill here. So all I'm going to do is to just swipe up. And now you get to cast your skill based on, like, different skills with different rates. But for this one, I'm just gonna put it here. And here we go. We have some animation as well with the LC. Five kills right there with the swing of a sword. There we go, with the victory screen. The battle looks exactly like what I had before. And yes, it looks good. It feels nice. It's just, you know, a casual game. You read through the story, experience it. You got a sick general. And let's continue on our quest, man. We'll follow the waypoint. And let's just explore a little bit of the uh, areas here. You have a lot. Yeah, look at this. They're actually interactable objects here. So I'm just to do that, save someone, and there you have it. And of course, if, you, if there's something glowing on the ground, you can pick it up. It really has some open world vibes to it, which is really unique for, for a game like this. It's an AFK game, right? There we go. Save them as well. Suspicious mad. Now the village is burning, and bro says, such beautiful flames. And yet, even the random NPC like this, you actually have cool dialogues that you can read through. There we go. Can you smell it? You're enjoying this? Yes. What the heck is wrong with you? Some prefer peace while others favor destruction. You know what? This is what you can expect from the story, man. It's actually kind of funny. Yeah, that's totally normal, dude. Don't look at me like that. Right, so those are like little tidbits of the game. And continuing on, we got some more interactable stuff here. And yeah, we'll proceed with some battle. And now for some animation. So, you know, the story starts with you having amnesia. And now you're just stuck in this, you know, sort of conflict. And in comes the hero. We've got this guy, the main dang character, man. Look at him. It's just exuding <laughs> gloriousness. Yeah. Now, that is something that I would fall in love with. My favorite male character in the game is, yep, this guy, Valid. You are now responsible for Risley Bears. <laughs> <laughs> huh, redhead mage? Sheesh. More like redhead god, am I right? And for some animation. This is actually a new one. I don't think this was something I watched before, but yeah. This got some massive bakery. Oh, right, here we go. What's happening? Oh, so we got some gust of wind. Ah! 
And there we go. That is, you know, some, that's new. I've never seen that happen before. But anyways, we have some battle. Let's go. We have our redhead mage and Rowan, which is this little guy right here. So this should be a pretty strong team. We should have no problem with this. And with that, I think we should be good, right? Never mind. We are kind of being destroyed. Ugh. But don't worry. I've got an artifact. All right. This is where they introduce the artifact, which actually heals my team, I believe. But... That's assuming if I need it. I don't think I do though. There we go. Done. That is one of the tougher fights actually for a tutorial, but that is where they introduced to you the artifact, right? And more animation. There's actually a lot more at it now. Look at that. Right, I'm definitely gonna say, right? These animations are not the world's most best animated stuff, but whoa, we're, we're going avatar mode. Jesus. But yes, for, you know, a casual mobile AFK game, 3D dang solid. Now, like, this is kind of enjoyable if you're like just going for a casual AFK adventure, but here we go, <laughs> whoa, so like that was just too funny, though. Got some slow motions as well, okay, and boom, avatar mode us, saving the day, we got him, oh, yo, I'm like, I'm, I'm looking crazy, man, but there we go, do I just, <laughs> I just pass out just like that, expressionlessly, how are you feeling? I'm great. I didn't just ascend into Jesus. So that is actually, oh, we got Lala. Look at that. But yeah, that was actually a really sick animation that I've never watched before. If I remember, this is where they should give you the same one. This is an animation for the summons. I think it's the same. We'll find out though. There we go. That's a purple spark. That means it's a four star. Not, not the most rare one. But anyway, there, that's a fair right there. And we have one more. Wait, was this like the case before? Is this where we get the redhead mage? I'm pretty sure we get our DPS here, right? And no, never mind. This is not a redhead. It's not a mage. And it's ugly. This might be a rerollable thing, guys. But either way, I mean, I'm fine with that. One thing about this game is, from what I've read, at least, most of them are good. You can definitely play a lot of modes with any character. So as long as you play who you like, that's all good. Now, I like Faye, but I definitely hate whoever guy that I got. And well, just by opening up the mail, I got 40 pools. Why not spend them? Let's go, man. Here we go, with 40 servers. Let's see what we get. Hopefully get something good. I had some insane rates before. Let's see here, dude. Do I get a gold? Oh, 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 that's a gold. <laughs> Oh, wait, this is pretty lucky, though. You're not supposed to be that lucky. Oh my god, I got her again. That's my favorite cat. Oh, there's some retexture in as well. Her eyes did not glow as good as this before. We're just destined to be, man. I keep getting sis here. And yeah, she is absolutely busted. So I am thrilled, man. Yo, my account's blessed right now. What the crud? I mean, we actually got three more, in fact. Not gonna be that lucky, though. Can't be that lucky every time, right? But assuming the first set was just a guarantee, which I'm not sure about, let's see if I can get another gold here. We should. Oh. Oh, yeah. I don't know why I said we should, but we did. There we go. Got him. And here we go. Oh, oh, let's go. We got the gosh dang healer girl. I forgot your name. Healer. Two gosh darn epics. I will take that. How about the final 10? This should be the final 10 if I get another one. Oh my god. Does it stop, dude? The rates are insane, actually. I don't know if it's like, you know, just a beta luck, but for me in the PTS server and the beta server, they are both really lucky. So I can't wait for release. If, it's, if they're going to be that, like, you know, generous with this, I would think a lot of people would enjoy. And this, I think, is a new one. I never got you before. Holy, we got Brutus. But all right, for the first 20 minutes, I've already got three new epic heroes. Isn't that insane? What in the world? And that, ladies and gentlemen, is our new round table. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of gameplay for the beta server. So yes, for my verdict on this game, it's you know, as expected, it's pretty chill. I haven't progressed through a story quite that much yet, which I'm not going to spoil out for you, but for now, my experience as, as a newbie, it's pretty enjoyable. You get a lot of stuff just by logging in, just by playing a game, and the rate seems pretty dang good. I don't know if I'm just lucky or something. But yes, I might be covering more of this. This is a sponsored video, so do check out the links in the description down below. If you like games like this, you know, stay tuned for more. And that is all. Hope you guys enjoyed. Take care.